Floods, tornadoes, and typhoons may take minutes to unleash their wrath, but lightning needs less than a second to display its lethal power. Give me 100 mile an hour winds, give me tornadoes off in the distance, uh, even flooding to an extent, but lightning, lightning freaks me out. It may not even be raining, and you think, hey, I'm safe where I am, and then boom, like that. December 2010. With cloudy skies in the distance and no rain, a photographer in Darwin, Australia, tries to capture an image of a lightning bolt. There's no way you can actually take a picture of a lightning bolt unless you're very, very lucky. So what they have is these lightning triggers on top of their cameras, which detect the infrared signature that comes from a lightning bolt. But this day, the photographer gets more than she bargained for really scary. I mean, that thing was extremely close. I mean, they probably felt that. In fact, they definitely felt that. I mean, look, she jumps. Just how close? The bolt hit an estimated 600 feet from the tripods. A lot of people don't know is that these lightning bolts that strike outside of thunderstorms are much more powerful than the lightning bolts that are actually in thunderstorms. The current is much higher in these lightning bolts because they're, they are positively charged bolts.